been so long since I posted a motherfucking video. Alright, bruh. Look, this is gonna be the best motherfucking slashing dribbling ISO build on fucking 2K25, guys. Alright, look. So this motherfucking build is six motherfucking eight. It go crazy, bro. Y'all gonna see in a minute, bro. I call this my LeBron James build because I did give it some playmaking, you know. You're going to see in a minute, but what I want y'all to do is I want y'all to hit that subscribe button. I want y'all to like the video for real, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to make some 2K content for the rest of this year. This game is actually kind of fire compared to the last few years, but the dribbling is what's really got me, bro. The dribbling is so fucking fun, but nah. Let's quit yapping and let's make this damn build. All right, so you're going to make it 6'8", 205 with a 6'11 wingspan. I already know this, even though I'm taking forever to do it in the fucking video. I'm sorry. Motherfucker, the first thing you want to do is give this bitch a 96 driving dunk, bro, alright? You want to dunk on everybody in the motherfucking paint, bro. That's all I'm saying, bro. I'm going to show you some clips here in a second. You're going to see me dunking on everybody. You're going to give it the 85 vertical so you get the Hall of Fame posterizer. You're going to see the Hall of Fame posterizer this year, guys, is so fucking good. Look at this shit. You just dunk on everybody. It don't matter. Meter dunk, no meter dunk. Yam. It don't even fucking matter. I'm dunking on everybody. Here's another one. Yam. Even the fucking putbacks are sweet, bro, on this shit. No lie. Look at this shit. I don't even got rebounding like that. Bam. Putting that bitch back in. Motherfucking windmill on his head. Ha! You know what I'm saying? Like, it dunk on everybody, bro. So you want to get that bit to 85 vertical. Then we're going to do the, the speed and shit next because you probably just want to go ahead and know what this is. You know what I'm saying? I did a 70 agility, and I low-key haven't seen too much of a problem with it on the defense. I'm not a super defensive build either. I don't even have my perimeter up yet on this build, so I can't even really show y'all what that's like. But the 82 is low-key not bad from what I've seen. It is definitely workable to get contest. You get silver challenger and whatnot, so... You're going to give this bitch a 68 block, though. You want to know why? Because that fucking high-flying denier is no joke, bro. I ain't even fucking lying. These are not all the clips I got. I wish I would have clipped more. But I be chasing shit down all the fucking time. Now, here's where it really gets nice. You get the 86 ball handle. You get the silver ankle assassin. 80 pass act. And you're going to do a 75 speed with ball. I forgot to put it on right here. But peep some of these fucking clips, bro. I'm telling you, you can dribble however the fuck you want on this game with an 86 ball handle, bro. You do not need a 90-something unless you're just trying to be faster, which I respect because I was getting kind of boxed in this clip. But it don't matter. Still dunk on him because the dunks are broken. Now peep this shit. You can hit this spin move every fucking time. It gets you so open, bro. I ain't going to tell y'all yet. If y'all want it, let me know. But peep this shit, bro. It can throw steamers. You get ankle breakers, snatch, green, as y'all can Never. see, the shooting is fire on this build too, bro. I got that big green bright on me, look at him, ankles gone, green, different jumper, it don't even matter. No, get the I'm bump steal, step man. back, where the fuck is he, he's on the floor, green. The ankle breakers are fucking back, baby. I don't even have, I have silver ankle assassin. Imagine if I had a higher ball handle build. That's all I'm saying. So, look, I already showed y'all the shooting a little bit with the last clips. This is the 85 three ball. Trust me. This is all you fucking need, bro. You can get chicken jump shots. You get bronze limitless. If you really want silver limitless or gold dead eye, you can just, you know, use your badge upgrader on that shit. But me personally, I fucked with the 85. I was trying to make a slasher, and this bitch shoots better than I expected anyway. So, you're going to do a 60 interior with an 82 perimeter defense because the 82 lets you get silver challenger. And from what I know, Silver is pretty decent for most spots in this game from what I've seen. And you're going to go ahead and get that silver interceptor and that silver glove because it's cheap as fuck this year. So why not just go ahead and get that so you can get steal sometimes. I do have the steal up a little bit and I was I wish I could get some more clips to show y'all. But I ain't really been clipping everything. I've been too busy playing the fuck out of this goddamn game. It's so fun. But listen. 61 free throw. You're going to get that bit of 80 driving layup. I wish I put some more layup clips in here, but like I said, I ain't even really been laying the ball up like that. I've just been dunking on people. And the 80 pass accuracy, I haven't really got a lot of passing clips either because I'd be forgetting to clip shit, like I said. But yeah, you just pretty much. You be, I'd be throwing that bit down the court all the time. Look at the badges. You get Hall of Fame Posterizer, Hall of Fame Aerial Wizard. You don't really care about the Aerial Wizard, though. But yeah, you can still catch them lobs like that. The lob posters are nasty. Silver Dimer, you got passing badges besides bailout every passing badge. You have every dribbling and handle badge on silver pretty much, which is pretty fucking nice. Um, yeah, this build is pretty fucking nice. That's all I got to say. You can even shoot off the dribble. I don't really got clips like that, but you can shoot off the dribble. You can see some of the takeovers y'all can get. You get driving dish, driver, finisher, fluid shooter. You know what I'm saying? I was peeping on some of the other takeovers because I ain't really seen all of them. The orchestrator is nice. It lets you fucking just throw straight steamers, bro. I'm telling you because it just ups your pass accuracy and all that. So, 
but yeah nah this i've been having way too much fun on this game and this is this is just my first build yo like i'm gonna make an iso build for real for real at some point with like a 90 something ball handle because i want to be able to fucking speed boost all over the goddamn court because the six sixes look nice again this year the dribble moves they get compared to the six eights are kind of crazy like because you can't get the ball handle on the six eight that you can on the six on the six six or six seven the 6.7s even look kind of nice this year. But the 6.10s are also mad broken. But yeah, this build right here. Shades of Paul George, Lou Hudson, and Brandon Miller. Yo ass is going to be an in... What the fuck? You guys going to be an inside out shot creator. This build is the toughest build. Like the damn video. Subscribe. I'm going to post more soon. Catch y'all.